Bro, I don't get it. Everyone says I've got like clown feet in it. Just cause, just cause my feet are big. Like, I don't get it. Is it my shoes? I think. What's the problem, bro? My shoes are normal. Maybe, maybe yeah. Your feet are small. How about that? Oh. Ah. Ah. Yes, people, Halloween's around the corner. We're doing one set per exercise. Whole point is to kind of, you know, master the art of doing less, but for more, if that makes sense. But uh, yeah, heading to the gym now. And I don't have any of those like fucking, like muscle receptor things where it, so it shows like, how effective it is. I'm gonna show the pump, and if the pump is good, yeah, then you can go and try it if you want. If you don't want to, then carry on with the training that you want to do. I'm not gonna shame anything that you do. Do your own thing. If you wanna, if you wanna copy the workout, I'm gonna show everything I do. So yeah, give give it a try if you want to. It's just literally like if you wanna change shit up a bit, then try this. That's all I'm saying basically. Because I've been doing this shit for a long time. A long time. So yeah. If you wanna do it, if you don't, don't. Just watch and enjoy. Whoa, hold on. Rewind that rep right now. See that? Yeah. Don't do what I just did. Don't drop the weight when it gets too hard, yeah? Just drop the weight and do more reps if you can't do any more of the same weight. Don't do what I just did and be a little bitch. So this exercise, you can see, it's improved a lot better in terms of intensity because I'm doing a lot more reps than I did in the first exercise. Compared to if you do a regular three sets of 12 with, I don't know, two, three minutes of rest. When you do that third set, you're still not putting enough effort in compared to if you do one set and you're performing it how I'm doing it now. I promise you, because when, when you do a set like this, a high intensity set, you make sure the reps count because you've got one set to do. And if you don't do it correctly, then you fucked up. That's the whole premise that you have to draw into your head. You have to make every rep count.
the same and I want to meet up, meet up. They say she low down. It's just a room and I don't believe them. They say she needs to slow down. The baddest thing around town. She's nothing like a girl you've ever seen before. Nothing you can compare to your neighborhood. I'm trying to find the way. So the workout's finished now, just got back and I'm not even going to lie, I feel more burnt out from this workout than I do from any other like back day. It's probably because like you're not used to putting that much effort in one set because you, you've got three sets and you think, oh, I'll just save the effort for the rest of them. When you've got one set, you just leave everything on the table for that one extra. You'll be like, oh, if I'm not going to do this again may as well like you know go to actual failure on it now if you're i've got i've got tips on it for this if you're gonna if you're gonna do this style of training i think the main thing you need to kind of prioritize is drop sets and supersets so for example i was doing biceps and i'll i'll do as many as many reps as i can with one weight and I'll drop it down, do as many reps as I can with that weight. And when I literally can't do another one with that weight, I'll put it down for like three, four seconds and then go again. And then you're done. Because like if you hit failure with one weight, you can always, you can't finish the set there because there's always a bit more room. A bit more room to go to failure. I think those will be very useful in this style of training. So make sure... It's important to track everything that you do because for today I, I tracked everything from the weights, the reps, the sets, the exercises, the effort level, the RPE, you know, like the whole shebang here. So when you do that workout again, you're not just doing junk volume, you're actually improving. One of the best back pumps I've had in the world, to be fair. So... Um, I'm quite excited to try it for you know legs and chest because I haven't done it for chest yet. Yeah, I'm gonna make it a little, just like a little mini series, just to do you know different workouts. So chest, triceps, shoulders, uh, back and biceps, legs. 
this is the back and biceps episode. You know what? The leg day episode will be recorded tomorrow, which is Monday. Everyone's hitting chest then. So, yeah. Look out for that. Tune in. Stay up.